Backward lesson do you have planned this time, eh? Shooting Crabane to prepare us for the mighty Grog? You wanna hunt Grog? So you shall. But not just any Grog. This is a rare one. It's territorial. Strong enough to claim land as its own. And you and me, we're trespassing. Tell me, Captain, you ever slay a Grog before? Today will be the first of many. Now you're talking like a hunter. I've got a feeling in my gut you may survive this, Captain. Well, since that's the largest part of you, I like those odds. So I assume you have a plan to kill this Grog? I do, Captain. And since you're so good at taking orders, I'll tell you how, step by step. Step one, when he's crunching on an Uruk, sneak up behind the giant beast and bleed the bastard's ankle. But why not his throat? There is one place Grogs aren't covered in spiky scales. They don't call a weakness a Graug's heel for nothing! You want me to sidle up to this beast? If you can manage it without being crushed, yes! There it goes! What a fine, fine specimen! And it'll meet a fine end. to pierce its ankle if I want to bleed it. Step two, Captain! The blood will attract Karago! Jump on one before she jumps on you! Your speed will now match the ground! Get her to chase you! I'll be waiting! That will be quite a ride. Carago for speed. Step three! I'll distract him using my wildly charm. Well you, Captain! Sweet him in the head! Sounds easy enough.
There is no scaffold! They should be dead! He must have done it wrong! I'm following your orders! That's your problem! Think for yourself! This of Mordor doesn't seem to touch that. Dwarf. The Seven Rings of Power did not turn the Dwarf Kings to wraiths, as the Nine Rings did to man. They are a stubborn as stone and cannot be dominated by evil. That is why Sauron has sworn to destroy them.
Torvin. Heads up, Captain! <laughs> Time to go hunting! <laughs> I assume you know the path. The real question is, are you ready to travel it? Whatever happens during the hunt, think what would Torben do? Actually, that's a good life lesson for you to follow always. I pray your training sticks, or else you'll stick to the wall once the mighty Graug hurls you there. I'm ready to fight the Graug. And that's just what you do. Fight! No art, no finesse! The hunt isn't about swinging and slashing, it's bigger than that! But from your perspective, Dwarf, everything is bigger. Yes, this Graug is very, very big! Oh! Oh, wait, you're mocking me. Graugs are one of the oldest species of Mordor, and the deadliest by far. It's been a long time since I faced this crowd. Let us hope time wasn't as gentle to him as it was to me. My old partner and I once tracked a Graug from Mount Dolmed to Nogrod. We finally slayed it and got stuck under his leg for two days. Ah, those were fun times. Last time I saw the beast was when my old partner and I tracked it into his dwelling. How did you get out alive? Luck. The growl knocked me senseless. When I came to, it had ended my partner. Facing that creature alone was a death sentence. I'd been hunting this growl for almost a decade. That's a lot of years of dedication to one beast. Dedication? Or a sign you preach better than you hunt. Oh, that's funny, Captain. I'll be sure to laugh when the beast eats you alive. The mighty Grau will be my legacy. Dwarves will tell tales of Torvan the Hunter for generations. And I'll have them throw your name in there somewhere. are too quiet. I don't think the Grog is home. <laughs> then we go in and we wait. Ambush. How military. I like it. That's just as sharp as the day our father made it.
myself. Let's just do as Torben said. Rule number one. Never mind, we improvise! It's too strong! I must attack from afar! A shot to the skull to disorient him!
I think he's dead. <laughs> ah! Ah! Well, that's what I call beast hunting, eh? Indeed, indeed. Next time I'm not gonna let you have all my fun. Oh, no, no. This is the last time. I'd rather come to pursue. Well, you need help with your journey, so what do you say? We put oh, some no, chance. No, 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 no. I have to do this alone. If you survive, <laughs> come near the Blue Mountains. <laughs> and lots of friends that will drink until the kegs run dry. I've seen how much a dwarf can drink. <laughs> I do hope our path's possible. Thank you.